Here to break down some of the secret taxes or the taxes you don't know about that are funding this bill, which is now a law, Florida State Representative and Speaker of the Florida House, Will Weatherford. Uh, Mr. Speaker, welcome. Thank you. Happy Marco to be here. Marco Rubio had that gig, right? Yes, he did. So hopefully you're on the same path for you. Uh, <laughs> uh, Representative, first off, what have you discovered? First off, on this Cadillac plan, so those horrible rich people that have these great plans, what's happening to them? Well, first of all, you just mentioned it. They said they weren't going to raise taxes. Obamacare is the largest tax increase on the American people. And there's you know, numerous taxes. One of them, that Cadillac tax, is basically a tax that says if your company or your employer gives you a really good tax plan, if it's too good, we're going to tax you for it and make you pay 40% on the dollar for, in taxes. And it's just ridiculous. So that is part of why the unions are so upset. Yeah, they don't make the most money. People think Cadillac, but they get the best benefits, and now they're up in arms. That out to 2018 so that hopefully the unions wouldn't get too upset, but now the unions are freaking out. Now you're talking about flexible spending accounts. This is this thing that people use sometimes when they want to eat up some of their deductible. When it starts up a new year, you could pay gradually. So now they're going to be taxed and capped. Well, they could, and not only that, but people with special needs children use uh, flexible spending accounts. It's a way for you to set money aside that's not taxable to spend on major medical needs. And now they've capped it at $2,500. There used to be no cap. This is going to help the spray-on tan people, 10% for indoor, uh, indoor tanning services, remember? Yeah, I call it the snooky tax. I mean, you have to kind of feel sorry for the cast of uh, Jersey Shore because now how are they going to you know, function with but, uh, you know, and I live in Florida, so we've got the natural uh, sunlight. But honestly, it's just another tax that they're just putting on the American people uh, to make their life a little bit more miserable. So when you say things like we're going to be covering everybody, it is not a, it's not a charity. This money's coming from other people that to, to get the 30 percent, the 30 million covered. Now, on medical devices, this might be the most unpopular element mm -hmm. and most universally disdained element in this plan. Well, we've got a lot of medical device companies in the state of Florida, and what this does is it puts a 2.3 percent tax on every single medical device. It's just, you know, it's one tax after another, and the fact is they sold the American people that this wasn't going to increase the taxes on them, but when you look at the individual mandate, the Cadillac tax, the premium increases we're seeing now, it's the biggest tax increase in America's history. All right, so this, this is, uh, as it as it comes down right now, we have a situation where the President of the United States is saying waiver, 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 individual mandate. But what is happening is it's going out of balance. The revenue side, there was argument it was not going to balance anyway. Now it has no chance of balancing because he's putting it all on hold. Brian, is it's a train wreck. You know, they're delaying their own laws. They're, over half of the, the dates that they set forth and said, we're going to follow these dates in law, they've ignored them. They can't stick to their own dates. And now they want states and they want all the American citizens, you know, to pay for this thing that they can't even implement with their own powers. And, you know, the people of Florida are going to decide elections and they're going to have local and national. And we'll see how this goes. He is the Speaker of the House uh, in Florida. Thanks so much for joining us. Will Weatherford. Appreciate it. Happy to be here. All right. Uh, meanwhile,